Hello everyone, so welcome back to my videos. Today, I'm going to be doing like what's in my everyday makeup box. Excuse me. What's in my everyday makeup box? Um, so yeah. Like my hairstyle, I did like a messy bun sort of thing. Okay, but what's on my lips right now, which I don't wear on an everyday basis, but I thought I would tell you guys, even though the lighting is not the best, but this is like the best lip color I have. And this is the Milani Lipstick in Rose Hip. Oh my gosh, I love this stuff. Oh my gosh, I love this stuff. It's just like the brightest pink. It's gorgeous. And then I use the BH Cosmetics Waterproof Lip Liner in Raspberry, which looks like that. Really gorgeous. It's a little bit darker than the Rose Hip, so you have to be, you have to make sure you blend them together. But let's get on to what's in my, well, it kind of fell, so everything's kind of everywhere now. But... There you go, usually it's all organized. Okay, so I'm not going to go in any particular order or anything like that, but I will tell you, I didn't bring it with me, it's over there. But I do apply my moisturizer, which is my Proactive Green Tea Moisturizer. So yeah, let's get started. Uh, I guess I'll try and go in order if I can remember. Um, first thing is my Maybelline Fit Me um, Concealer. I use this underneath the eyes and it just is gorgeous guys I love how this looks underneath the eyes it's amazing I'm in the shade fair I I just love this stuff and if you are dry you're, you have dry skin this is amazing it'll give you like that dewy look underneath the eye amazing okay can I say amazing enough next concealer that I have is my Bennett oh by the way guys I meant to say in the beginning but this is kind of like my monthly favorites, but not really. Because some of the stuff you have seen before, I just really love it. That's why I always keep it in there. But some other stuff, you know, that I don't keep in here, but I use a lot. You know what I mean? So, I'm still going to do monthly favorites. But yeah. You get what I'm saying. Okay, this is the Benefit Boing Concealer. You guys have seen this in many favorites video, I'm sure. And this stuff is just amazing. Um, I'm in the shade 01. I use this now for concealing my acne which I don't really have any acne I just have you know zits here and there so amazing love those both concealers of those I don't know what I even just said there okay to set that those to set both of those concealers I use the Rimmel Stay Matte Pressed Powder in Transparent I love this stuff it's amazing but I don't think I'm ever gonna run out of this I don't even see the littlest bit of a dip like seriously this thing is gonna take forever to use up but anyways I really like this stuff. It keeps, um, I do set it underneath my eyes, but I try not to put too much because I don't want to make that matte. I want it to look a little bit dewy. But for the, um, concealing the Boing one, not concealing, um, setting the Boing concealer, then I'll put on a lot. Well, not pack it, whatever, okay? <laughs> Next face thing, and I think the, yeah, the last face thing is the e.l.f. blush in Candid Coral. I actually just switched this out from my NYX blush in mauve because I realized I haven't been using that a lot and I wanted to switch it up back to this. So this is in Candid Coral. I freaking love this stuff. It's amazing. It was my first e.l.f. blush and I think my first blush ever. But it's just amazing. I love this stuff. And um, it lasts on your cheeks all day. Next, um, let's go to eyeshadow. So first I have my Sigma eyeshadow base in Persuade. I'll show you the name, I guess. Persuade. Yeah, don't look at my nails. They're growing out pretty bad. Okay. So, this is what it looks like. This is just an eyeshadow base, kind of like your MAC Paint Pot. This is almost like Paint Chili, I would say. I don't own that, but, um, I don't know. I feel like it would look like it. <laughs> um, but this is really nice. It primes your eyelids and, you know, conceals all the veins. So, sometimes I'll even just wear this and some mascara and then leave... But, um, yeah, I wear this when I wear eyeshadow, too. Obviously, it is an eyeshadow base. Okay, um, eyeshadow, I guess, right? Um, I have been really loving this BH California collection little trio here. This, if you are subscribed to Ipsy, which is a $10 month subscription um, service, then you would have gotten this. I think almost everyone did. Um, but BH Cosmetics made, you know, their three palettes. They had the Hollywood, the San Francisco, and the Malibu one. I have the San Francisco one, so I already have this color. But, oof, I would have never used it. This, like, this made me use it, and I'm just like, I love this stuff. Um, but this is an amazing trio. I love it. Um, what I like to do with this one the most 
is put Malibu, like for an everyday look, I would just put like Malibu on the lid, this in the crease, and that's it. But if you wanted like a nighttime look or something, smoke it out a little or something, you can take that on the lid, this in the crease, and then take this on the lower half of the lash, and then put this in the inner half of the lash. It Lower lash line, sorry. But it makes it, oh my gosh, I just love this. Like, I, I don't think you can get this like on the BH website. I'm sorry if you can't, but this stuff is amazing. So it just has like a really yellow gold color, a like bronzy color, and a purple color. And the purple is the only matte one in here, so really like that trio. And that's good if you're just going on like a two-day vacation or something and you don't want to bring so much eyeshadow with you. You can just bring that and then you can make a bunch of different looks from that. Okay, I guess we'll go on to eyeliners. I don't have gel eyeliner in here because I really haven't been wearing it that much. I'm not into it at the moment. So I have two eyeliners. I have the NYX Slide On Glide On. Stay On, definitely a turn on, right? I think... It's dream, yeah, something like that. Eyeliner in Purple Blaze. Looks like that. Oh my gosh, this is my favorite colored eyeliner. It is just fantastic. Um, I will never wear this on top of eyeshadow. Like, I usually do it on my upper lash line. I'll just do it alone, like, with no eyeshadow on. It just makes your look so much more better. Then I just have a black eyeliner, which is the Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Eye Pencil in Zero. So I, I like to tight line with that or, yeah, just tight line with that one. Okay, mascara, and I curl with my Sephora eyelash curler. So for mascara, I feel like I do videos so incredibly fast. I don't like that. We're going to go slow. <laughs> for my mascara, I use the Wet n Wild Mega Volume Mascara. I actually don't have that on today. I have another one on. But, oh, please go and buy this. You can get this. I don't know if you can at your dollar store, but my mom got it for me because, I don't know, she just wanted to. Um, but she got it for me, and it was a dollar at the dollar store. And I love this stuff. This is, if you guys have ever tried the CoverGirl Clump Crusher, you, you know, it's not supposed to create clumps. That's actually what I have on now. It does create some clumps. This, not one single clump in your eye. Of course, unless you probably build it. I've never built built it before, so... Yeah, but the wand is not all that fantastic. I, I When I first opened this, I was like, oh no, I'm definitely not going to like this. Because of the spacing. I don't like when they're so spaced, I feel like it just clumps your lashes. But it really doesn't, guys. This is an amazing mascara. I totally recommend this. If you like separated, long, volumized lashes. Okay, so two more things. I have two lip colors. Um... First one is the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in Milan. I love this stuff. I love the way it feels. It's just like velvet on your lips. <laughs> it's amazing. And it lasts all day. Well, you gotta reapply when you eat. <laughs> anyway, next is my Marabella Lipstick in Daydream, which I got in my Ipsy bag on March. March Ipsy's bag? I don't know. But this is like, of course I have lip color on, so you can't really see my lips. This is like my lip color, but better. So it's almost like, because I don't really have any new lipsticks, if you get me. I don't know. I just haven't, I don't know. I just haven't tried any, you know. I feel like they would like wash me out. I don't know. I've never tried. I should try, huh? But, um, yeah, it just looks like that. And I just really, really like this lipstick. It's almost like a nude for me. Um, but I love the formula of this. It's extremely moisturizing. And, Yeah. So you probably are going to see me the same exact thing in a couple more of my videos because, you know, I did this hairstyle and I'm like, why waste it? Let me just record some videos. So I really hope you guys enjoy this video and I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.